Money Control presents Intelligent Investing Simplified by Share.Market, a phone pay product. Hi everyone, I'm Himanshu Sahu, Head of Engineering at Share.Market, which is PhonePay's foray into stockbroking ecosystem. I'm in conversation with Rahul Chari, co-founder and CTO at PhonePay. Welcome Rahul. Thanks Himanshu. Rahul, it's been an year since we have launched Share.Market. What are your views on how we have grown? I think it's been an amazing, amazing 2024, really. It reminded me actually a lot about our early days launching the PhonePay Payments app. Uh, the growth has been phenomenal. Uh, we've crossed, what, 1 million yeah. active DMAT accounts on Share.Market, yeah. which is amazing and kudos to the team to have achieved that. See, Share.Market for us is strategically very, very important. You know that we actually uh, put our entire consumer journey into this send money, spend money, manage money and grow. It has passive investments through mutual funds for the more educated, and the more savvy investor, I think investing in equities plays a very, very important role. And Share.Market is the product that actually completes that picture. So it's strategically extremely important. But more than that, I think the execution brilliance that we've shown over the last year to actually build very quickly on a very recent launch, it's been what, less than a year and a half yes. since we've launched. Yes. And to be more iterative, in getting share market to the point that from all the things that we hold very close and dear from a phone pay tech perspective, scalability, reliability, performance, yes. all of those, I think the product has, uh, share market product has shown a lot of goodness and I'm really proud about that. Raul, I'm glad that you brought that up. In fact, we have taken these core principles from phone pay and we are building on top of it. Security is one, uh, aspect that we are focusing at share market. We have uh, multi-factor authentication in place. We have also integrated with phone pay score FRS systems that that brings in super intelligence to detect all of these frauds early on. We are focused on scalability and stability also. We use cloud providers so that we can scale on demand, which ensures stability and scalability both uh, without compromising on speed. For reliability, we have a lot of redundant lines in place with exchanges and all other providers. So this has given share market a very strong position, technically. That's amazing. In fact, it's actually also a great validation of the tech that we have built as a group uh, in PhonePay. A lot of the capabilities, I believe, that share market is leveraging, whether it is on the KYC front, yeah. like you mentioned, on the uh, risk and fraud detection Sorry. systems, uh, orchestration platforms, leveraging that common functionality that has been battle tested through phone pay, I'm pretty sure gives a good yes. edge to share market. Absolutely. And uh, one of the other things that sets phone pay apart is the fact that while we build great tech, we solve for scalability, we solve for reliability, we solve for performance really well. We also have a very keen eye on what the consumer needs are, right? Tell us a little bit about how share market solves for that aspect of the product always delivering for what your consumer wants. That's very interesting, Rahul. In fact, uh, we follow a very deep philosophy where product managers at Share Market get involved at every aspect of users. Uh, to give you an example, our product managers read all the reviews across our platforms. They read all the tweets. They actually get into ticket resolution, working in tandem with our customer support team. This has given us enormous amount of information around what users want. And then we bake in into our roadmap, product roadmap. And uh, using this, just to give you an instance, we have realized lately that few of our users were giving feedback on navigation, right? We have quickly picked that up. We have sol solved that. And now we have a new trading panel for all our traders, which is uh, very seamless. The experience, the navigation, the order placement is very seamless on that. By the way, I love the new trading panel. Thank you. And I love the fact that we can actually uh, upload our Excels. Yes. Uh, that's also an extremely cool feature. Yes. So now to be able to actually tie in what your consumer is telling you to what your platform can deliver, the key thing is using data. Yes. Right? How do you actually use data? Would love to hear certain things about potential insights that the data has given the engineering team, the product team to build new features as well as how data is being utilized to action upon the consumer feedback. That's absolutely right, Rahul. 
Uh, in fact, data plays a very pivotal role in our complete decision making process. Uh, using this data, we, our product managers actually tie this back to develop new features for our users, which enhances user experience further. Uh, for investors specifically, we have something called as wealth basket. These are curated baskets of stock that we offer to our users. Using data, we process a lot of parameters across, and then at frequent intervals, we suggest our users to rebalance these baskets. Right, this is one such important thing that sets us apart from our competition. For traders, we have specifically a uh, trading panel that we have recently launched. A lot of data went into analyzing how users were interacting with the app. And from that, we realized the navigation patterns. We realized how people are using specific type of stocks. So considering a lot of these uh, different users, and their segmentations, we have built a proper navigation and that is the trading panel product that is live right now. And uh, I think everybody should know that while ShareDot Market has leveraged a lot of capabilities uh, from the broader PhonePay uh, uh, technology team, it has also brought in a lot of new capabilities, not just from a technology perspective, but also from an understanding of a new channel. Share.market Market is the first product really out of the uh, phone pay group that is serving not just as a mobile app, but also as a desktop. And I think the team has done a brilliant job in trying to actually cover the gap between what a mobile app can offer from an investing perspective and what a, uh, a desktop experience can offer. So kudos to your team for that too. Thank you. Now, now, now that we've spoken about data and data intelligence, can't not talk about Gen AI. And I think there's a lot of potential, everything from content creation to be able to actually do portfolio analysis and a whole bunch of other things that Gen AI and capabilities offered by LLMs and uh, specifically uh, LLMs that are tuned to this domain. So what are your thoughts on that? Um, thank you for bringing that up firstly, because our team is very deeply now evaluating how these things can help us, the LLM, the Gen AI, that is talk of the town these days. Uh, we are in fact using, in fact evaluating, doing POCs of some of these Gen AI models that we'll be using for uh, enabling our customer support team. We are thinking a few things around VoiceBot that would solve real time problems of our users using these Gen AI and LLM models. We are also using these for our algorithmic research. In fact, uh, you brought this up, the web property that we have, right? We are. Uh, these web properties are usually used by very veteran traders. Uh, we are building a sophisticated experience for them where we are using algorithms, we are trying to find trends and opportunities in specific areas and specific sectors. And this, uh, we are using a lot of these models, LLM models, to enable this research for our internal teams. So yes, um, I'm very sure that there are a lot of opportunities that we will find as we move forward. And uh, while building products, I believe Gen AI and LLM models would prove to be really beneficial, which will translate to a great customer experience. Of course. And in all that we do, I must add that we always look at consumer privacy and consent at top of it. In fact, uh, as a group, we are looking at saying that how can we actually try and move more and more intelligence to the edge, uh, the ultimate edge being the mobile device itself. While the LLMs and even the SLMs today may not be uh, at the point that they can be run across all the use cases on the mobile phone itself, I believe at some point we'll get there. And I think that should be the goal to try and offer as much of the AI driven intelligence on the mobile phone itself so that it takes care of both giving the best consumer experience as well as actually catering to the uh, privacy of the investor and the user. Absolutely right. We are aligning to that. We are in fact very focused on making sure that user privacy is maintained and we do as much computing as possible on the edge on the device. Perfect. That's great. So then given that all of this is covered, what's next? What's in the future for ShareDot Market? Can you give us a little insight into what's coming up in 2025? In the last one and a half years till we have launched, we have heavily focused on security, scalability, reliability, what we just discussed, right? Next year, we'll be focusing on new features that would enable our users to take better decisions. 
for specifically traders, we are uh, launching visual trading using charts. They can actually trade on chart itself. That is um, one of the cool features that the team is working on, along with some smart order types. Um, iceberg orders, there are multiple such orders. We are building a smart order platform on top of which all of these different type of orders can be built. For uh, investors specifically, we are building a flavor where people can build their own wealth baskets using the research that our team has done. On top of that, uh, there are stock SIPs, like you do SIPs for MFs, you can do SIPs for specific stocks. Uh, along with this, there are some new cool features that are on the way. I hope our users like those features. Amazing. Really looking forward to all those features. I think uh, some of the ones that you mentioned uh, would be extremely, extremely useful, even for an uh, uh, investor who is not necessarily very advanced. Like uh, a stock SIPs is very interesting. And of course, chart-based trading, etc., would be something that all traders would love. So congratulations on a great 2024. And here's wishing ShareDot Market and the PhonePay group are the very best for the coming year too. Thank you, Rahul. Thank you very much. It is always lovely speaking with you about these growth aspects and innovation. I hope our users like this conversation too. Thank you for having this conversation. Money Control presents Intelligent Investing Simplified by Share.Market, a PhonePay product.